I have made it to the Grayson Highlands State Park in Virginia. Pretty stoked, even though it's pouring. <laughs> I'm interrupting uh, a date. Sorry, buddy. I'm running her off. Yeah, chase her. Chase her down. Yeah, you're going to have to go faster, bud. So just went in the visitor center and spoke to the park ranger, Veronica. She was super nice, super nice. So I asked her where the best spot to see the ponies were, and she said up on Massey Gap. But she said during the rain, sometimes they'll kind of go off and hide and stay dry, of course. But yeah, she said it's probably going to rain all day today and all day tomorrow. So dang it. Dang my luck. All right, so I'm going to go back to find a campsite. And, um, yeah, see about some food. I'm starved. It's 3.40. I've not eaten today. I need to fix that. All right. This is what's happening at the Lost on Land Again campsite. <laughs> I know my daughter doesn't watch my YouTube channel, but if for some reason you ever see this, Jesse, thank you very much for that umbrella. It's pretty dang perfect. It's a, got a little thing to hook to, like, a chair or something, but it happens to fit right there just right. That's kind of awesome. Good morning, friends. I woke up here at Grayson Highland State Park in Virginia. Pretty much did this all night long. This little dribbly rain thing. Well, it was lovely for sleeping. It's no good for pony hunting. Anyway, what are you going to do? So, yeah, I'm going to uh, get my van in order. Go drive over to a little hiking spot, see if I can't spot a pony before I head out. Man, I probably slept the best last night than I have on this whole trip. This was fabulous sleeping weather for sure. Look how beautiful it is out there. A little bit foggy. Yeah. It's alright. A little rain, probably screen, that's for sure. I know it's really wet out there, but that's cute. I love it. They can be outside in the rain. All right, so yesterday when I was in the visitor center, I was talking to park ranger Veronica, and she said that usually the ponies are up on Mossy Gap, but in the rain, a lot of times people just don't see them anyway. It's not only rainy, but we're like in the middle of a cloud. The visibility is almost zero. So it's a bummer. But it is what it is. I went ahead and took a drive up here. She said sometimes they're seen up here. I don't think they've seen anywhere. They're wild ponies. So I'm going to slowly make my way out of this park. She would love to see one of those magical beasts. But if I don't, I don't. I shall come back another day. The pony stock. Yeah, it's supposed to rain like this all day long. Good times pull down here to this little day use picnic area. Wow, it's so pretty. The only thing that would be better if there was a pony standing there saying hi to me, but oh well. I get it guys, it's raining. You don't want to stand out here and be filmed. Wow, that's pretty. The size of these rocks. Cool. It's a nice state park, Virginia. I'll give you that. I am entering the town of Damascus. And, uh, trail days is about to start, so you're going to see a lot of this. A lot of hikers. Trail days, May 18th through the 20th. I think today's the 17th. So timing is everything. I would not be able to drive down this street tomorrow. Alright, there's the outfitters right up here. I know there was a grocery store here somewhere. I just don't remember where. Oh, ducks. There be ducks in the middle of town. 
Yep, it is raining. I finally got some cell phone reception. So I pulled up the weather and it's going to be raining in this area for the foreseeable future, let's just say. So I was going to go up to the Green River, the Gauley River and that, but it's just going to be doing this at least through Friday. Well, today is Wednesday and uh, yeah, I really only have one night to mess around up here and then I have to start heading back west. Otherwise, I'm going to end up driving, you know, 800 miles in one day. So, command decision time. I'm going to Indiana. Why? Because it's not raining there. <laughs> Actually, I don't know where I'm going to land tonight. I'm heading kind of up. I'm going to go through Kentucky. I might end up camping there tonight and then on to Indiana for Thursday night. But we'll see. So nothing at all is written in stone on this trip. Playing it by ear, and that's sometimes the best way to play it. So yeah, that's pretty much it for now, just driving in the rain. See, so yeah, I haven't been able to watch any YouTube videos or anything, but a lot of time whenever I'm driving, I can pull up a couple of my favorites like uh, Deborah Joy or Glenda Sully because they tell great stories. So I can sit here and drive along and listen to their stories, but you know, I can still focus on the road. So that's kind of fun. It's like traveling around with a friend. So yeah, if you don't know who Glenda Sully is, y'all go check her out. She's got a great channel. She's kind of doing her own little autobiography. And then uh, Deborah Joy, well, she's just Deborah Joy. If you don't know who she is, yeah, go check her out too. I will attempt to put a link in this video for those ladies, but uh, yeah, the reception's been real spotty, so it's been really hard to get videos out while I'm on the road. I've got one all ready to go. It's on my computer, but um, yeah, haven't had been in one spot with reception long enough to mess with it, so maybe tonight. You never know. All right, that's it for now. Catch you down the road. Anyway, that's it for now. See you on down the road. Don't pull out in front of me. Don't do it. Don't do it. Thank you.